Hello friends, today I'm in Big Bear, in the mountains in California, at least for now. So I was up here for the weekend with some friends. Uh, we went snowboarding yesterday, that was uh, yesterday. <laughs> yesterday, that was, that was me right up there, yeah. And today, of course, is uh, Mincino Research Day. Unfortunately, I'm not sure how much of it I'm gonna be able to participate in because we're just picking up some food and then we have to head home. And that's like a two and a half, three hour drive. So, yeah, I'm hoping I'll be able to get a few research tasks in and maybe get lucky for the shiny later today when I get back to Long Beach. I would have loved to be able to dedicate more time to the research day, but unfortunately this trip with my friends was planned long before Mincino Research Day was ever announced. So, some people are watching the Super Bowl and missing research because of that. I'm driving down a mountain. I'm not gonna drive too fast. Eventually. Ah. So, clearly, well, maybe it's not that clear, but yesterday I wasn't able to make it home in time for Mincino Research Day. By the time we made it down the mountain and I dropped off all my friends, unloaded the car, and then got home, it was too late. Luckily, Mincino is available in the wild after research day, so if you did miss the research day like I did, uh, you still will be able to catch Mincino. It's gonna be a lot harder to find the shiny, but hopefully some of your friends caught a lot of extra so you can get that in a trade because that's what I'm gonna have to do. Now, today I wanna talk a little bit more about Go Battle League. Uh, I didn't do any battles over the weekend. Like I said, I was with friends. This, this trip had been planned for a long time, so I kinda just left my phone to the side uh, and spent the weekend with friends, which was a lot of fun. But now I'm back on the Go Battle League grind, and I'm honestly not doing very well. So I just, I, I want to say, don't be discouraged if you're not um, winning a lot of battles. Just keep practicing. Keep practicing. I'm, I have 14 wins out of 25 battles right now. But what I want to talk about today is Scraggy. Scraggy is a Pokemon that you may have seen, and maybe you're wondering how to get it. Maybe you already know how to get it. Well, here I am to confirm the only way to get Scraggy right now is through Go Battle League. Once you reach rank four, it's available as a possible encounter. So here is Scraggy. And Scraggy's actually a really good Pokemon in Great League. So if you are interested in competing in Go Battle League, it's definitely a Pokemon you want. Now, again, being locked to an encounter in Go Battle League does mean that you do have to battle to get it. So again, like I said, don't be discouraged. To reach rank four, you actually don't have to win any battles. You just have to complete 15 battles. So you don't even have to win a single battle for your first uh, attempt or a possible encounter with Scraggy. Now, we do want PvP IVs, so I might have to trade it, but there it is, Scraggy finally. So once you're rank four, you do have to start winning battles to rank up. You have to win five battles to reach rank five. You don't have to do them all at once, but I have won five. I have not won five. So I do need to win a few more to rank up. So again, don't be discouraged. Uh, you have as much time as you want. But if you are struggling to get some wins, again, check out some of the PvP resources that I linked under the last video. Um, lots of great channels there with a ton of information that will be very helpful in getting your wins and getting your scraggy. Many hours later. Did I mention how sore I was earlier from snowboarding? I've just kind of been relaxing all day, but kind of worked out because a Mincino came to me. This little guy must have heard that I missed the research, research day, and decided to come pay me a visit, rewarding my patience. So, I know there's a lot going on in February. Please don't feel like you are obliged to participate in everything that's going on this month because there are a ton of events. So, if you have stuff scheduled, with friends or family or appointments or whatever it is, work even, uh, don't stress yourself out too much. It is just Pokemon Go in the end. I know sometimes people feel a little bit overwhelmed when there's a lot going on in Pokemon Go. So just remember, uh, do what you wanna do. Don't feel too much pressure to play. If you miss out on some special event or Pokemon, there's always people who are willing to trade with you. So just keep that in mind. Um, 
All right, kind of a short video, now spanning three days of filming, um, but that's just the kind of weekend it's been for me. Uh, there was a lot going on. So I just want to take some time now, since we have it, to talk a little bit about mental health. Um, if you remember, towards the end of last year, I was talking about how I was having a hard time um, mentally and, and kind of going through a phase of depression. Um, since then, I've been seeing a therapist regularly once a week, and it's been incredibly helpful to be able to talk through things with um, a professional, you know, get advice and feedback um, and, and affirmation and validation for the way that I'm feeling. And since then, I've started working on a lot of things to help improve and, and kind of lift my mood. And maybe you've noticed it in videos, maybe you haven't, but I've definitely been feeling a lot better. Uh, I've recently reincorporated meditation back into my regular routine, and that has been so helpful. Um, and I, I really recommend that anyone try it. I used to meditate very regularly before Pokemon Go, before the channel took off, and then I went into like full work mode, fully focused on the channel. I talked about that in the last video where I was kind of talking about um, depression. Um, and it just kind of derailed my meditation practice. And, and now that I have that back in my life, I've honestly been feeling such a huge improvement. So just a quick mental health update for anyone who cares. I hope you enjoyed the video. More coming. Again, there's a lot going on this month in Pokemon Go. See you out there.